When you're running a content business like mine, reviewing products, managing sponsor deadlines, and pushing out videos across multiple platforms, having broken files, guys, is a real problem. One single corrupted video, a blurry thumbnail, or an audio track filled with static can de derail an entire project, waste hours of editing, or even jeopardize a brand deal. That's why tools like 4DDIG file repair matter. This is about recovering deleted files. This is about fixing the ones that are right in front of you, but just don't work. Whether it's a glitched out video that won't play, a photo that opens but looks like mush, or a distorted audio file you just can't clean up. I'm gonna show you exactly how 4DDIG file repair fixes these in the real world. Today we're gonna to walk through four repair types. Video, photo, audio, and document. I'll show you real before and after results, and at the end, I'll walk you through the official 4DDIG website, so you can see exactly where to go to get started, and how to try the software completely free. Let's get into it. If you still like the video, subscribe to the channel, check links below, um, and also check links if you wanna sign up to 44DIG file repair. Okay, so if you wanna follow along with me and actually download the software, go to the website, which is in the links below, and click on free download. This will download the software and enable you to follow me through this complete demonstration software. It brings you to this screen. So today we're looking at video repair, photo repair, we'll demonstrate each of these. We'll also talk about file repair and audio repair. They work in exactly the same way. And then we'll look at AI Enhancer. So I should go in there and enhance a video that's in very low quality, enhance a photo that's also in very low quality, and also colorize a photos. And you can also colorize videos. So a full review to look at each of these features. We'll go through them in detail and just show how easy it is with click. How easy it is with click. It's that easy to create. Okay, now is actually video repair. So you can use two ways. You can actually use the app, which I've got here, or you can use the online version. We'll go back to the online version where you can actually use it from the website later. We'll start with the video repair. Now, the great thing is this fix videos if you can't open them. So say, for example, I've got this video here, which I actually took on my holidays. So if you open it up, document not found. So it's actually been corrupted. The great thing with 4 DDIG is it's so easy to be able to do it. So how do we do that? Well, we go to video repair, we click the button, we click add videos. Now we go to that video I just mentioned. We put it on there and press enter. Then we press repair. So as you can see, look how quick this repairing process is. If you're using other forms of repair, some of those don't even work or they take forever to do. And look how quick that was. Now you can preview it there as well. So there is a video just there. Doesn't that look absolutely lovely? So if you want to go and have a look now at the actual video itself, so we go save and we go um, save it to go to there and we export it. So there we go. And now we've got the video. Just, isn't that absolutely fantastic? So let's do that process again, just to show you guys another one as well. Have a look at a photo from the actual same trip that we went to. So we go to add photo and we go in here and add it from the file. So as you can see, we've added the photo just here. Again, we can't actually open it up. So if we go here, try and open it up, look, we're getting an error. So we go here, press repair all, and hopefully we can gain access to the photo again. So here we are. You can preview the photo and have a look. And there it is. So there we are in the snow. And again, save it. And there is a file. And look at that quality. Absolutely amazing. And there we are, there is a photo that we nearly lost in beautiful 4K quality as well. Isn't that stunning? Same process to do audio repair and also do file repair. Now the great thing with this repair is it just is literally one click. Compared to other programs that takes forever to do it, here you literally just click on there, drag the file, and it repairs your files straight away. It's absolutely brilliant. So next thing I want to look at is actually the AI enhancer that's built into the software. Now, say you've got a low resolution video or low resolution photo, it allows you to upscale it to great quality. So let's go and use an example with video. So I'm gonna add, add a video from when I was in New Zealand. I got back and the resolution was too low in it. So we're gonna go upscale this video up to 4K. So as you can see, it gives you general model, which allows you to do the brightness of the whole scene. Uh, you've got face model, which does people's faces, or anime model, which turns it into anime. I'm going to start by just doing the upscale to the full uh, times by four resolution. So up to 5120 by 2880. We'll do quality first. You can do speed, which makes it a bit quicker. Um, but we'll go for quality because we want a nice, very high quality image, and we'll have a look at it. You can see it's actually completed the resolution. Now, already in that video, you can see how much higher the resolution is. You can preview it to 10 frames. So if we have a quick look and press it, you can see, look at the detail in that. We'll show you the full file later so you can have a look. 
And basically it's as simple then as going in and pressing export. So we export it and we save it in. So we open that and we export it now. The video's just been exported in uh, the four times quality. Now we're going to open it up now and have a look at it. So here it is just here. Now, if you have a look, uh, press play. So you can see, look at the increased quality straight away. The detail, the colors is far more defined than in the low resolution image. You can see all the details there. If you compare that to the low resolution video, uh, which is just here, as you can see, look how blurred out the people are in the low resolution one. And to look at how, in, how good they look with the high resolution one there. So much better, much better colors as well. As you can see, look at the sky, how detailed it is, the walkways detail there. Uh, this is a low resolution one, so far less detail in it. And it really does upscale the image quality beautiful and allows me to go and see my New Zealand trip. As you can see, it just shows full detail and look how lovely the picture is. It allows me to see my New Zealand trip in true 4K style, absolutely beautiful. How I can upscale a photo as well that's in low resolution, low quality. So again, we select the photo, we put it in here uh, and we add it in there. Now this is a photo just here, as you can see, there's not a lot of features involved. Um, you can see how the pixels aren't very good at all. So we need to make sure we get this fixed. So we add it here. Now let's go and do, again, you've got the, the denoise model, which removes grain in the background. General model, which adds sharpness, colors, and brightness. We'll go for that one. I'm not too worried about face model. You'll do that if you're using your face directly. What we'll do is we'll choose the quality first, just because we want to see the best quality we can for the image. And we'll press start enhancing. Okay, so now it's done. So you can see the difference. So here is the low resolution. So it's one, four, two, seven by 803, and this is afterwards. Now look at the quality there in the image. See how it's very undefined, very blurry. You see with the upscaling, look how clear that is. Look how beautiful that is in the background with the mountains. It really is a lot better. So yeah, there it is there. Now we'll go to replace it and I will have a look. Okay, now I'll show you guys a difference. Here is the original photo. As you can see, very low resolution. You can't see much detail there in the mountains and the clouds, very poor quality. And after we did the work, now is the enhanced one. So as you can see, look at that. See the clarity in the mountaintops. You can see the lines in the snow, the clarity in the face. You can see the grass there, much improved picture and far better quality as well. So it can help really restore your pictures, your videos, excellent. Started. Well guys, go to the official site, download the software for Windows or Mac and install it. As you can see, when you launch it, you have four options. Video repair, photo repair, audio repair, and file repair. So you can choose what you need, drag in the file, and start. Once it completes, you can preview the fixed version before you export it. Now guys, to unlock the full features, you can create an account using your email, it takes seconds, and after that you can activate your license. And get unlimited file repairs, full previews, and advanced AI modes for image and video enhancement. And again, this really has transformed the way I do content because no matter how well you film, what you do, the final output can vary quite a lot. So yeah, it's fantastic. So as you can see here, here's a full DDIG website homepage where you can find the repair tools. We can download for free and where you can test your own files in a couple of clicks. Guys, here's my verdict. Four DDIG file repair actually works. It fixed a video that would have ruined my entire shoot. It restored clarity to a photo I'd actually written off. And the UI is clean, fast, and designed for real people. It's not magic. And in eight out of 10 cases I tested, 4DDIG repaired the file enough to use. So if you're a creator, student, parent, or anyone who can't afford to lose their work, this is worth having it installed. So guys, check the links below as well if you wish to join it. Again, easy to start, easy to use, and great output. Um, and if this video helped, don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment. Have you ever had footage that you wanted just didn't work properly? Have you had blurry photos? Let me know below. Uh, and we're also doing a giveaway at the moment for up to $4,000 worth of prizes. So check the links below if you wish to join and uh, make sure you subscribe, like the video. And um, I'm Andrew from Mr. Yoohoo and I'll catch you on the next one.